that would help with your of a little jetpack, I can show you where I was spawned before. If you go in my direction you can see that it's a gigantic sea of lava. And it was here I spawned. If you remember correctly, it was here. <laughs> they say Mr. Gas. With this said and show, it's time for look for some fuckers. Luckily, I don't have to go much far. There it is. Another fortress. With some blaze already. We are rescue. about the bronze machines even though when you reach the industrial level you want to keep using it because they give you more and work faster it's not easy on the beginning of a game because you are constantly running out of power and to power at the beginning you need to burn coal and believe me you burn coal so much faster. And on the other hand, because the bronze machine are powered by steam and when full heated, this even this is more coal boiler can produce enough steam for your machines to do a lot of work. In the beginning, it would be until you get a good way to power your machines. It would be better for you to stay on the Bronze Age, at least for the most simple machines like furnace, smelter, compressor, extractor, and even the grinder. Grinder is a good way to macerate your coal and coal dusts. Now I'm talking about the blast furnace. For now, I think the Bronze Blast Furnace is better than industrial at the beginning for simple reasons well to industrial it was a iron ingot as ever but you also need to coal dust you can do charcoal and aside of that you need to feed it with 60 500 thousand of EU and since the beginning you're gonna use more coal energy this means that for every steel you make you're gonna expand like 20 coal while this you should spend f for charcoal and time this is what we get most of you it's time it takes so long but it's so cheap and I really think that I should make just more bronze blast furnace to make it still over time, not industrials. When I have enough power to it runs constantly, maybe I should change. But for now, shipping is better. Well, 
It was a simple conversation. Not much else to talk about. Now it's time for... Make little improvements, build more machines, get more resources, and try my luck. Now, a new machine, just to get a little different. <laughs> Good. Now we have the Greg Tech Wire Mule. Why? Because it produces more cables than the Metal Former. Now, the only reason for the Metal Former to be used is to convert these plates. In casings, and they do this more efficient than your hand or the or the machines. And since you can now make some cables, we can also do other things. Like this, because we need it. Oh well, <laughs> I do need it. I don't know how this cable did not melt down yet. Just kidding. But it's hard to keep the it powered. I spent so much charcoal, even with this little contraption of another rock furnace, a hopper pushing wood in the pipes to push in the furnace and get distracted by the hoppers because I don't want to make a conveyor belt for every one of them. Make you think I have a good amount of charcoal, but it's ending pretty easily. It's already over. But oh, I have power. So minerals is better to keeping macerating and we're rushing like the iron because doing this in the industrial grinder I'll get all the materials but I don't need them for now I need more iron so if you want more of the mineral the primal mineral macerate then war wash it you get more of it in the industrial grinder you used to get other things like you can macerate tin and get uh, zinc Copper and nickel. Iron, I would also get nickel, but for now I prefer to have more iron. So, this is basically just some more machines, and we are basically done with the basic. <laughs> so much work, so much work. Now let us make a simple canning machine. 
because we need it. Cell tank, fuel cell phone tank, fluid rich in camp. 